So hello there and welcome back to the channel. This is Mel's Gaming here with another Way of the Hunter video. Now in this video we are once again going to be taking a look at some new info for the brand new map that is coming on the 6th of February, Matariki Park, set in New Zealand. So today the Steam achievements list was actually updated with the achievements for Matariki Park. Now I actually saw this in the Way of the Hunter official discord which I will link in the description. Now here you can see we have a number of achievements from completing the story missions, completing all job requests, all task challenges, shooting a sandbar deer in the heart, discovering all points of interest and collecting all stamps. But the one really really interesting achievement is to gain passes for both Matariki Park private hunting areas. So from this we know that there are obviously going to be two different private hunting areas on the map. There'll be two areas of private land, which is really interesting because the private land tends to have better genetics for animals and you'll need to either earn the passes by completing missions or by actually purchasing them. So that's really interesting. And talking of interesting info, this little tidbit was dropped in the official Discord. So someone asked one of the devs, can you tell us how many species we're going to have on the new map? And the reply was 17 overall. So there are going to be 17 species on this New Zealand map. We do not know that full list yet and it has been said that we are going to find out very very soon. So I'm very excited to find out what the full species list actually will be. I'm expecting we'll see things like fallow deer and chamois also included on this map but I wonder what other sort of new species we might see. So this is a really interesting bit of information and this will make the New Zealand map have the most overall species out of any of the existing in-game maps. Now another interesting thing that popped up again shared in the official discord was this image of a seeker deer. Now we didn't get the clearest look at the seeker in the actual trailer so this is really nice to see and the model for these guys actually looks pretty good. I'm actually pretty impressed. I hope that this is like a, a smaller mature or something because I hope that we'll see some bigger antlers. But overall this looks pretty good. Now this guy does look different to the ones in the trailer. The ones in the trailer have much more sort of orangey reddish colour fur with much more distinctive white spots. But it could be that this is just like an older mature of this species and that the coat sort of fades in coloration as they get mature. Or this could be a different coat overall. We know that the feral goats and the feral pigs are going to have different coat colours. So maybe the seeker do too. It will be interesting to find out. But that could very well be just a an example of what a mature looks like having that sort of more dullish sort of more grayish color fur but overall it looks really good so a couple of really interesting pieces of information today and i'm really still very very excited for this map the more and more that we hear and see about this map it just gets me more and more excited 17 species is really fantastic that's going to provide a lot of variety and I cannot wait to find out what the rest of those species are going to be. As soon as we do get a full confirmed species list, I will do a video talking about it. So hopefully that will be very, very soon. But that is going to be it for this video. I really hope you have enjoyed it. I hope you guys are as excited for this map as I am. And just thank you so, so much for watching and for all your support. As always, you guys are amazing. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you.